Hello everybody, this is just going to be a quick update to tell you what's going on. Um, some of the people on Steam, well, sorry, some of the people on YouTube will probably be seeing this before they actually get to see my uh, latest episode, but this is just a quick update to explain why I'm not updating yet. Um, as of right now, I'm still on point 10, and there is a point 11, a point 12, and I think a point 13 out right now. Um, they're all, they all have good mods. Um, they all have improvements to them. Um, the main issue right now, as I've noticed, everything after point ten does not yet have uh, Tinker's construct in it. So that means I lose my tools, I lose my tables, um, I lose my smeltery. That took me like three or four episodes to get to do so um, and you know I kind of like my hammer and diamond kit pickaxe so um, yeah now there are some good reasons for doing the update um, for one thing we do have a mod in here for something of an inventory tech related uh, playthrough, which is Formaticra. If I can spell that. Which, apparently I cannot. Um, basically, Formaticraft is a um, it's, it's kind of like a Steam-based mod. Um, not this. You uh, make pressure. You have pipes that you fill with steam. That steam then creates um, powers all your machines and the whatnot, including. Um, I think it has an ore doubling process. Um, it has little drones uh, which you can program to do things like uh, make food for you, and they're powered off of that steam. Um, there's a couple different things about it. Um, the problem is, is it's not yet ready. Um, kind of is annoying that I can't figure out, can't remember what it's called. Um, or rather how to spell it. But, um, the short version is it's not yet ready, which is the reason why I'm not doing it. Most of the stuff that's in here um, does show up as uh, like missing textures um, and it even has notices on there that you shouldn't use it yet. Mm. I don't know, maybe they took it out of this one. Um, There's one. There it is. No one has PC robotics. Okay. Okay, well maybe it's not in point ten, I guess, but it was up up until point nine. Um the important, th the important thing to know is that in the new updates, point 11, 12, and the newest one, I'm not sure that is 12 or 13, there is a um, new mod that it looks very similar called Pressure Craft. It's a little bit more simplistic, kind of like uh, how Furnace is more simplistic than the Pulverizer Macerators. Um, but it does look to be a viable tech-based build that I would like to get into. Um, the problem is, is like I guess I, I use my Tinker stuff, and I'm not really ready to part with that yet, because mm, Pressurecraft has no um, tools or drills or anything like that. So I'll be stuck with the uh, vanilla mining pickaxe. Not the end of the world, but I just like how Tinkers is so easy to modify and so easy to repair. Um, even if I went with 
the Thumbcraft tools or the Botania tools, which would likely be my alternative option given the choice. Um, both of those aren't as easy to repair. I mean, the Botania ones, I know you can use mana to repair them, but you actually have a de have to have a decent Botania setup to get mana reliably. So, so as things stand, um, right now I'm going to be staying here with point ten. Um, I'm hoping in the next day or so um, they are going to update um, and include the, the new Tinker's version in it. If so, then yes, I will definitely be upgrading. If not, well, that would be unfortunate. Um, but I, like I said, I could probably live with the Botania tools. Um, there is also the problem right now where like the Funatic Craft, um, Crusher Craft is not fully ready yet, um, and it also relies on copper and lead, which is not generating in all of my worlds so far. So I would have to go someplace where I have not spawned any chunks. And as you can tell, I kind of explored the area around me quite extensively, uh, and I'll start combining there. Um, if I use like a BC quarry, which yes I can afford right now, well actually no I can't, I don't have the gold to do that. If I use a BC quarry, that wouldn't be so bad, but uh, having to make a mining outpost out there would be troublesome to say the least. So for right now I'm not going to be updating to the new stuff yet, but uh, maybe in the very near future. I just wanted to get that out there for everybody to know what's going on, and um, hope everybody's okay with that. But we should be upgrading. If if it updates and gets Tinkers in it, I'll be doing it tomorrow at the latest. Uh, unfortunately, uh, I don't think you'll be seeing that until probably Saturday on YouTube. Um, Saturday, Sunday, somewhere in there. Um, but if need be, I mean, if it like updates to like 14 or 15 and there's no, still no Tinkers, I'm going to have to kind of assume they're going to, they decide to take Tinkers out. Uh, it's no longer being tested or maybe it's not being updated enough or whatever the case is. And in that case, I might actually make a new world, um, which will be a pain because, because frankly, all of the setup I've been doing here, particularly the Thongcraft setup, has been a little bit time consuming. But it is an option. And if that's the case, then, you know, I'll just make a world, get a base, and get myself back to where I was, at least as far as research goes. But it's not the end of the world if Tinker goes away. I mean,. I've already told you, everybody, that uh, Thumbcraft is very gold heavy, and Tinkers has already eaten up about 12 bars of gold, which isn't the end of the world. But it's gold I could have used elsewhere, and it's kind of making me, it's kind of making my progression really suck right now in Thumbcraft. So that's where we are now, and that's a zombie behind me. Um, goodbye, Mr. Zombie. Goodbye, YouTube and Twitch. I hope you guys understand. Um, if you have any tips, tricks, or anything else, feel free to shoot me a line on whichever medium you choose. Um, otherwise, have fun, and don't be a stranger. <laughs>